Hello and welcome to the Intos Agency Block Integration Demo. Uh, first thing I want to mention here is that uh, for full functionality of everything that I'm going to show you here in real time, you do need to have the Intos dashboard up and running uh, in a browser tab. Uh, we prefer Chrome. Uh, it doesn't have to be up on your screen, can be minimized on another monitor. You're also going to want to have uh, yourself logged into Agency Block and have at least one tab of Agency Block up and running as well. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, simulate uh, an inbound call and uh, show you what a call, call pop looks like and uh, what you can do from that. So uh, bear with me here just one minute. Uh, while we're doing this, I'll just mention that you can either have your virtual phone enabled or disabled, uh, but the, uh, the function here will, will be a little bit different if you, uh, if you have the uh, dashboard running. What I'm going to show in this instance is I'm going to show an inbound call uh, coming in on a phone. I'm going to click Open in CRM. And when I clicked on that, it immediately opened a new tab and took me into Walter's record because Walter's uh, record was associated with the phone number that was calling in. Now let's say, for example, that you missed that uh, call notification and didn't get a chance to click on it or somebody else answered the phone or whatever the case may be. Uh, no fear, come back here to the dashboard and you'll see Walter's name here then you also see it on the active call over here. So you can click on Walter's name, get this interim window that's going to show you his name, the organization that he's with, and also who his servicing agent is. Then from here, I can click on Walter's name and it will take me right into his record. Beautiful. Now, the other thing that's going to happen during a call like this is if you wanted to have your calls recorded, which is something that we offer, um, that call recording can be started, stopped, paused, whatever you need to do uh, during, the, during this uh, call, and that's also going to be logged with the, uh, with the call itself. Now, we can turn on auto logging for you if you want, uh, but if it's not turned on, you always have the capability to come in here uh, under call history, and you can see that all of these um, are showing as plus signs. And so I can click on any of these and I can um, put in a, you know, a brief subject and maybe I can type in a lengthy or brief description of whatever went on with that call. And, and spell check uh, is something that, that works here as well. Um, since we support multiple CRMs being integrated simultaneously and also the capability that if, let's say, uh, Walter had a, a phone number that was for his whole family and so there were multiple people in your agency block database that all were associated with that same phone number, uh, in this dropdown you'd be able to choose which person uh, did you want to actually log that call to. Uh, their record. And when I click save, it's going to turn that uh, plus sign into an arrow immediately. And when I click the arrow, it's going to take me right into that call log that was created. It's going to show it as a complete activity. Uh, it's going to show the, um, the, uh, the brief subject, what was typed in, the uh, information about the call. It's going to show whether the call was inbound or outbound the start of the call, the day and the time, the duration, the phone number that it was with, which notice is a click to dial, as will every phone number that's in Agency Block, will now become a click to dial, where when you click on it, it's going to say, do you want to call this number? And if I click OK, it's going to start dialing that number. It's also going to provide a link <clears throat> to the call recording um, that was made during that call. Uh, let me come back here and show you one more thing before I forget. And that is uh, when I mentioned that it supports multiple um, CRMs or multiple people in a database associated with the same phone number. Had it found other people in Walter's family, it would show those as multiple tabs across here. And I could click on a tab and it would show uh, 
that person's name and then I could go into their record. Let's say maybe Walter's wife was there and some children and, uh, and that type of thing. Uh, one last thing that I'll just show you here before um, I end this demonstration is the fact that uh, there's a virtual phone that is part of this interface here and I can easily just quickly uh, dial uh, a phone number. Uh, I can search. Uh, this is actually connected to a, a directory. Um, or I can just type, copy and paste or type a number in here, click call. It's initiating that call. Um, I can answer it. I'm now on that call. And I can go back to this interface here or back to this interface here if I need to see the keypad or turn the speaker on or put somebody on hold or transfer. I have all that functionality available right here. Alrighty, well thank you so much for your time here uh, today with this uh, Intos Agency Block uh, integration demo video. And I hope you find it helpful. And if you have additional questions, uh, give us a call. And uh, of course you can visit us at intos.com.